Hi friends, I'm back and we're going to um, do um, a ring grid of ED. You remember that one? All right, we're going to do that one right quick. So are you ready? Here we go. Ring grid of ED. Will you make a rhyme with When a clap, you say... Snap, good job. App is the rhyming, the ending sound that rhymes. Clap, snap, good job. Riddle dee dee, riddle dee dee. You say a rhyme with me. When I say raise, you say praise. Raise, praise. A's is the rhyming sound in that word. Good job. Riddle dee dee, riddle dee dee. Will you say a rhyme with me? When I say hands, you say bands. Ands is the rhyming sound at the end. Riddle dee dee, riddle dee dee. Will you say a rhyme with me? When I say air, you say Hair, air, hair. Riddle dee dee, riddle dee dee. Will you say a rhyme with me? When I say kick, you say stick. Riddle dee dee, riddle dee dee. Will you say a rhyme with me? When I say jump, you say bump. Good job. All right. All right, friends, we're going to sing our song, right, bingo. But in bingo, we're going to change and rearrange bingo's name. So I'm going to take off the letter B. B makes the what sound. Good job. I'm going to change it and re rearrange it to Singo. Good job, because S makes the S sound very good. Now I'm going to change it and rearrange it to Ningo. Very good, because this is N, good, and it says N. Good job. Now I'm going to change it to the letter P. Good job. And this says Pingo. Good job. So, what letter is this? Z. And what sound does Z make? Z. Good job. Mmm. My letter. Mingo. Very good. And we can also have the letter what? W. W. Ingo. Wingo. Good job. We have the letter what here? R or Ringo. And last but not least, we have T. Ingo. Tingo. Good job. Now we're going to put the letter B back on and we're going to sing the song. Are you ready? Farmer had a dog and Bingo was his name. Oh, B I N G O. B I N G O. B I N G O. And Bingo was his name. There was a farmer had a dog and Bingo was his name. Oh, I N G O. I-N-G-O, I-N-G-O, and Bingo was his name, oh. There was a farmer, had a dog, and Bingo was his name, N-G-O, 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 and Bingo was his name, oh. There was a farmer, had a dog, and Bingo was his name, oh. G-O. G-O, 
G O M Bingo was his name. There was a farmer had a dog and Bingo was his name. Oh, oh, oh. and Bingo was his name. All right, friends, I hope you enjoyed that. Now we're going to read a story. Okay, put this away quickly. So when we do this the next time, I'll have it right handy and dandy. Okay, so we're going to read a story about a soccer game. Guess what? A lot of my friends that I talked to over the last past week, they told me that they really like soccer balls. So guess what? I found a book about soccer. It's called Pink Delicious Soccer Star. This is a scholastic book and it's written by Victoria Can. Okay. Dad gave me a new pink soccer ball. That pink ball inspired me to kick and score like never before. I couldn't wait to play my first game of the year. Our team, our team is called the Pinksters. They are called the Ravens. Pink soccer balls are for babies, said Kendra. Tiffany said, Pink stinks. Play ball, said the coach. Think pink, said Rose. But I keep hearing Tiffany say, say pink stinks. I'll show her pink doesn't stink, said Rose. The ball came to me and I kicked it. I'm sorry. I went too short. Near the ball, I'm sorry, next to the ball, it went too long. Then it went crazy. Oops, I kicked the ball to Tiffany by mistake. She scored a goal and the goal was one for them, zero for the Pinksters. Rose scored a goal. Good job, Rose, I said. The score was tied. One of them, one was for us and one was for them. And two minutes left in the game to play. Then Kendra kicked the ball. The ball sailed high. I heard pink sinks inside my head. I had to get the ball. As I ran to the ball, Go Delicious galloped towards me. She scooped me up on her back and we left for the park far below. We flew across the sky. We saw girls playing soccer all over the world. We flew to the pink sands of Egypt. I made a great pass. And I did a corner kick in Spain. That's, that's think pink in Spanish. Cherry blossoms bloomed in China. Think pink. By the time we got to Italy, I forgot all about that mean old Tiffany. Go Delicious let me back, let me back into the game. I said, I've learned so much. I think I know what to do now. I ran, I got the ball, I took aim and I kicked. 
I did it. I scored. The Pinksters won. Three cheers for pink soccer players everywhere. Hip, hip, hooray. Hip, hip, hooray. Hip, hip, hooray. Guess what? Now we've learned in this story, do boys just play soccer? Nope. Girls can play too. I hope you enjoyed um, our lesson today, and I will see you tomorrow. Bye.